let's start with our press conference. Coach, give us uh, first the summary of what you saw, and members of the media will go straight to the questions. Oh, thanks, Bobby. Uh, I think uh, we came into this game, I think we, we thought it was going to be an easy game. And uh, we started very sluggish, you know, we considered the goal that we shouldn't have. Uh, early in the game, and then we started chasing the game. Though we did take attempts, we were still not uh, penetrating, you know, uh, creating goal scoring opportunities. Uh, the better part of first half, we're not moving enough, uh, we're not making the runs behind uh, the defense. We wanted to play in front of them, and uh, we were actually helping their, their block, you know, that they formed to be solid. And uh, against the run of play, we managed to, to get an equalizer. I, I thought now the game will be open, obviously. Uh, they were going to have to sit, but then be cautious. Uh, I mean, attack and be cautious at the same time. Uh, and then when we thought we were in control of the game again, then we considered from a standard situation. And we're chasing the game till half time. Uh, second half, I think we had a different attitude. Uh, really showed that we wanted to win the game. But unfortunately, we couldn't get the uh, blue collar and we ended up on the losses. Coach, um, that enforced change that you already spoke about over the weekend, how do you rate Kune's um, performance today? Unfortunately, you can't... Uh, uh, I would say Kune did well. He made some, some brilliant saves in the game, and unfortunately, he conceded two goals. And uh, when we concede, it's not... It's the defense should have done better. Uh, other players as well, the midfielders and strikers, which are now unfortunately we did not defend properly. And actually, before the one that they scored, there was another one that they said in close, close range. So I think they did very well. Uh, collectively, as a team, we have done better. Good. Looking at the subs today, you were chasing the game, getting over, you know, substituting Saile when you had also got a game. What was the, the, the thought behind that stuff, coach? Uh, I mean, he's been he's been playing, you know, week in, week out. We just had a game uh, over the weekend. I mean, the past uh, uh, week, which was on, on Thursday, I think. And you could see, uh, as much as you could, you could think, uh, he showed a little bit of energy, but... Uh, Thinking wise, I think mentally you could see fatigue in terms of uh, decision making. And also, we're thinking now about another game that is coming. Uh, we don't want to risk injuries, we have too many injuries already. And we're trying to find also the balance in the squad. And this week you lose this one, the next game you lose that one. I'm just happy that today all the guys that started and, and those who came off the bench. Uh, we were able to be having a good selection, which is very, very key for us. And uh, yeah, we will see how we're going to, uh, to start and prepare for the, for the next game. Coach, the, the, the defeat might mean that uh, you are out of the Champions League uh, spot contention, but mentally, doesn't it also give the players sort of a pressure now? I mean, we know Chiefs uh, supporters demand more, and now you're left the net bank up now. Mentally, does it? affect the players in terms of wanting more pressure in front of them? No, pressure is part of the game, more especially when you're part of the Chiefs. You have to deal with pressure week in, week out. Uh, yeah, uh, we're disappointed we did not win this one, but uh, second half of the game, we uh, need to blame them. You know, unfortunately, they missed the chances. Uh, but they showed a little bit of hunger. Just uh, expected them to start, to start the game like that. As I said, maybe we, we thought it was going to be an easy game because we are playing against a team that is uh, third from the bottom, if not fourth from the bottom. So uh, it's a case of mindset. Uh, as you said, uh, but we're going to have to keep going. We still have a lot to play for. And yeah, until, until the last game of the season, then we take it from the Coach, just to follow up on what he's saying, does this now make also the Net Bank Cup fixture more important as well because it's got also potential to lend you, even if it's a different competition in a Cup interclub competition too? Look, all the games are important for us. You know, we don't we choose games. I've always been saying this. Uh, we wanted to win this one. We wanted to win the 
previous game they played the evening before the fun and uh, even the next uh, uh, next coming game we will, we will go play out and give our best to make sure that we go on to the final and and there will be two more games to play before the final so there's there's a, there's, there's a lot at stake Let's go for the last one. Coach, you spoke about the defense, and when I look at it, you mostly consider on set pieces. I mean, uh, going forward to this uh, coming this game against the uh, I mean, uh, what would you uh, to say, uh, tell the, the defenders to organize themselves? Because it shows that uh, in a crucial match like this, they always concede, and surely this can be bad for, for the team. Ah, obviously, it's bad for the fact that. Uh, the you know, we give away points in games that we shouldn't have. You know, this is one game, uh, it's one of those games that we, when we look back, we lost games that we shouldn't have. You know, we control, we created chances, you know, and then you can see uh, uh, two goals like that. And then it's back to talking about the game. So, unfortunately, football is a game that we always have to, 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 to rectify. And uh, we'll go back to training. And, and look at ourselves and we can improve and keep on working, you know, uh, in the next two new games and uh, then the good chance of going to the final. So we we'll focus on that for now and, uh, and, and make sure we give our best in every game that we will play. Last one, I see you. Yeah, Coach, I, I just wanted to, I mean, uh, we have all seen the performance of the club, I mean, the missed chances and everything. But in the process of you trying to rebuild this squad, where are you in that regard? Uh, obviously, this is your first season as well. Yeah, look, uh, there's uh, there's a lot of uh, for me, there's a lot of improvement in the squad, uh, especially playing with young players and players uh, that I knew also, you know, in the setup it was always going to be uh, a bit of a challenge to, to strike a balance. Uh, uh, but I think uh, they did fairly well. Because they did their best all the time. Yes, yeah. some of the games uh, we thought we deserved you know, to, to, to win them and did not win them, and we learn from them. And we have to move on. We have to start thinking about the next game. And yeah, uh, this is this, this is one season that obviously we want to forget, but we still have a lot to play for. We never know what's going to happen. That's uh, that's football. You know, it's, it's a game of numbers, and it's unpredictable. Thank you, coach. Thank you, coach.